So what's occupational health? Uh, in the 25 years that I've been teaching on this course, the definition of occupational health hasn't changed. It's that relationship between health and work and work and health. And certainly in this course we focus mostly on the latter part, which is the effect of work and health. This, this course is very much geared at the safety practitioner, and a competent safety practitioner must know how to prevent work-related diseases. So even though the types of diseases that we've seen over the past 25 years have changed, we see about 50% mental health, 50% musculoskeletal problems now, it wasn't always that way. The way we go about preventing them really hasn't changed at all over that time. And so during this course, you're going to find out the, uh, the template on the prevention of occupational diseases. So that's going to enable you to take away and to apply in any uh, health and safety meeting that you may be, how you go about preventing occupational diseases in, in the workforce. It's a key competency that we believe we want to achieve as part of this uh, program. So traditionally we used to talk about um, what were the the old or traditional industrial diseases, your coal workers' disease and silicosis and, and, and so on. Now these are still important, but more so in the developing world than the developed world. And so a lot of the emphasis now is on mental health problems and on stress, on things like productivity in the workplace. And in fact, there's been a, a general move towards talking about integrated um, occupational health care, integrating uh, prevention of occupational diseases with health management and health promotion in the workplace. And the other piece of the relationship then, um, the health and how it affects work, is more re relevant to clinical people, the doctors and nurses in particular, but it's of interest to everyone who works in health and safety. The simple questions such as, when can I go back to work after an episode of back pain or after an epileptic episode, for example. These are relevant. It's, it's not our core part of the course because we focus more on prevention, but it is, it is of interest. And we've assembled a team of lecturers, all of whom are experts in the particular fields, to deliver the programme to you. Um, and we think that it will equip you to become a very, very competent uh, health and safety practitioner in the Irish workplace.